Super pumped, super excited, and I know you guys are gonna be too. So listen up, the Titan Medical Transformation Challenge is coming back. That's right, you heard me. If you don't remember the Titan Medical Center Transformation Challenge, let me just fill you in on what's gonna go on. So we're gonna do a challenge to get you in the best shape of your life, that Titan lifestyle shape, right? Now, here's the thing, we need you guys to enter. So you guys are gonna buy a shirt, or you guys are gonna become a Titan patient and use a Titan therapy. Either way, we'll get you involved in the Titan Medical Transformation Challenge. Now, what's the winner gonna get? This is the best thing. The winner's gonna get three months of HRT for free or therapies for free if they can't get HRT. If you don't want any therapies, you don't want HRT, then you can get free Titan gear up to $350 a month. That's what you'll get every single month to be able to utilize on Titan therapies, free HRT, or free Titan gear. So this is the pump up video. I'm gonna get you guys excited. I'm gonna release the date here very shortly. I'm gonna get everybody involved with this. All the Titan crew, all the Titan members, I want you guys to win. I want you guys to get in the best shape of your life, the true Titan shape you guys deserve. So guys, get ready, get excited, and make sure you keep it locked on social media because I'm gonna start releasing the details here in the next week or so when the date is and when we're gonna get started and get in the Titan Medical Transformation Challenge to get you guys feeling like a true Titan inside and out. Three, two, one, zero. What's up, guys? John here, and I'm with my beautiful wife, Sharice. Hey, everybody. And we are here at Cars and Coffee at the Enclave in Tampa, Florida. That's right, Titan Medical is out here, and man, this place is jamming. I think about 2,000 cars or maybe more that are out here. Uh, really special time here, the first cars and coffee at the Motor Enclave, and uh, me and Sharice are luckily owners of a garage here at the Motor Enclave, where you can race around an F1 design track, off-roading tracks, and they have a pool, it's a whole community for just motor enthusiasts. So at that point, like today, the public gets to come out here and try it out, Last night for the opening ceremonies was amazing, but today is just like, wow, wow. We haven't been to any cars and coffee yet. I know they're really, really popular, but I know I've talked to some people that have went to them and they've never seen anything like this. So it's that many cars out here. It's like, might as well call it a big car show because that's what it is. And it ain't like regular cars. I'm talking about there's some bad hyper cars, super cars out here, modified track cars, all kinds of different things. A lot of horsepower out here, and uh, I'm sure a lot of testosterone will go along with it. So right up tight Medical Center's alley. So uh, come along with us. Let's go check out some of these awesome cars. Check out the beautiful property here at Motor Enclave, and enjoy the day. Let's go. Cybertruck, this is the big hit. Everybody wants this thing, right? This thing's supposed to be a beast, not only in weight, but in power and speed. So this thing is super fast, right? And super powerful, like super powerful. And this thing weighs, I think, over 6,000 pounds. So it's super heavy. 
So that's how it opens right here. You see this? Yeah, so you open it up. Super big. I mean, it's super clean inside and super simple, which is pretty cool. Now, I'm not a big Tesla guy. I believe in Teslas. I think they're awesome. But um, I just don't like total EVs yet. But if I had my chance to get a hold of an EV, I think this would be the EV that I would get. So right now we're checking out the fly motion dog. If you guys haven't seen these, these are super cool electronic dogs. Oh and these God. things can do a, a variety of different things. I know the police are using them too. Um, you know, obviously for a number of different things that you can utilize. I mean, think about it. If uh, you want to send this thing inside, I know that some governments are starting to put, you know, weapons on these things like guns and stuff like that. So they can shoot people and not have to have any human casualties on their side. Even think about, even think about, you know, Diffusing a bomb or even taking a bomb and taking it away from this people, you know, movie. super cool, man. So the future is here. Fly motion, Boston Dynamic, big shout out. What a crazy time out here at the Motor Enclave for Cars and Coffee official. Uh, there's still cars coming that are trying to get in. So there's still a line wrapped. And this thing started at 8. I think it's like 10, 30, 11 right now. It's going to end in 30 minutes. It's going to end here very shortly. So people are going to get in. They're going to get parked. They're like, you got to go. <laughs> um, but seriously, amazing time. All these enthusiasts out here. The weather actually held up. Yep. We've got the Z06 out here today. And we've got the Lamborghini Aventador out here today, just part of the Titan fleet. So me and Sharice are rolling and controlling today. But man, it's just, it's, it's awesome to be around so many motor enthusiasts out here that have the passion for their vehicles like we do. And uh, it's good because this is, this is now part of our community, Yeah. right? This is our community, community, right? So we have our home community and then we have our motor enthusiast community. Mm -hmm. So our condo garage will be built here in a couple months. And uh, we're going to take you through the whole building process so you guys get to see it from start to finish. A big shout out to Motor Enclave and everybody that put this event together today. Thank you very much. Titan Medical Center, Titan Strong every single day. And uh, let's get out of here before everybody else jams it up. Better hurry up. We're out of here. We'll see you guys later. Hey everybody, Andre Adams here, down here at Titan Medical Center in Tampa. We came down this weekend, spent some time with the team, get a good workout, and then also talk a little bit about some of my favorite therapies. So I'm gonna start first off with Hercules Potion. As you guys know, that's one of the staples in my routine. Uh, today we actually went bilaterally, in the triceps, got a nice little pump up through the arms and shoulders. Uh, for me, I like to really target whatever muscle group I'm trying to train that day. Uh, but also you do get a systemic benefit out of that, right? So the arginine, citrulline does give you a pump uh, throughout your whole body. So one of my favorite therapies for muscular development and also just energy and focus. The other big thing that I've noticed is really that anti-fatigue effect. I'm able to train a little bit harder and longer in the gym before my body starts to really shut down. So you notice that also the next day, you're not gonna be as sore because your recovery is a little bit better. Uh, the other things I wanna mention, Nectar of Gods and Tri-Immunity. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen me talk about these quite a bit. Two of my favorite therapies for, again, focusing on boosting your immune system, um, recovery, all that good stuff. You know, even some arginine still in the uh, Nectar of Gods. But right now, you know, we're just getting out of cold and flu season. If you work anywhere in a social setting, a school, if you're in education, if you work in the gym, these are all good therapies to help boost your immunity 
and keep you functioning tight and strong you know, as you're trying to stay in shape and reach all your health and fitness goals. One of the key ways that I've used Titan as a service and a resource for my athletes and just my general fitness clients as a whole has been really starting with that blood work and that labs. So you guys heard me talk about this at NASM Optima last year, right? The importance of blood work, monitoring what's happening on the inside of our bodies. Without that, it's kind of like bowling through a curtain, right? You've got to really understand your key health indicators. You've got to understand any outliers in your blood work, any gaps or opportunities to increase your performance. So for myself, for my athletes, that's always our starting point. Before we start any kind of training or nutrition regimen, we look for um, all kinds of factors that are happening there from our CBC differential, right, thyroid function, hormone function, triglycerides, really that full spectrum of, of you know, health indicators. So definitely um, one of the starting points and you know, time and time again, Titan doesn't disappoint. I get the feedback from my athletes about how great their experience is. So, you know, regardless of where you're located at, you can schedule your labs remotely. Titan's gonna review them, get back to you uh, with some of those key insights and recommend any therapies or corrective actions that you need to take to improve your health. MK677, I boot a more in. So I gotta thank John and Drew for putting me onto that one. Um, just kind of educate me about it. It's been one of the most effective tools that I've used to go through this current bulk cycle that I'm in right now, right? So I think last time I was down here, I was about 212, 215 pounds, currently sitting a little above 230 pounds. And it's really just helped me put on that muscle that I've been trying to achieve. So definitely noticing it, even, um, you know, checking my labs previously, a few months back, compared to my current labs, we've noticed the IGF-1 numbers coming up. Uh, again, just synergistic with a good nutrition and training plan, helping me reach those muscular development goals. So I boot a more in, highly recommend it to anybody who's trying to focus on muscular development. And also it'll increase some of your appetite, right? It's a ghrelin mimetic. So again, a great all around product for you. Any and everybody can really benefit from Titan, whether you're looking at increasing the way that you feel, right? Your aesthetic physique goals. It could just be a lifestyle goal that you have. Um, relationship goals, antioxidants, anti-aging, all that good stuff. Uh, Titan really has benefits and services for anybody who's looking to improve their overall health. Hello everyone, my name is Cass, one of the nurse practitioners at Titan Medical Center. I wanted to talk to you today about some of our hormone treatment programs. One of them is IGF-1 insulinite growth factor, a powerful growth hormone that's beneficial for building lean muscle mass, helping with recovery, helping with anti-aging properties, improving sleep quality, and overall wellness. This growth hormone is made by the body naturally. However, it can be depleted for various reasons, illness, age, medications. So by doing blood work, we can determine if IGF-1 is an appropriate treatment for you. This medication is delivered via injection into the skin daily. And the best part about IGF-1 is it doesn't suppress your natural production. So this is a treatment that can aid you in keeping your levels strong within normal limits without shutting down your natural production. So if you're interested in learning more about the insulin -like growth factor, give us a call at 727-389-3220 or visit us online at titanmedicalcenter.com We'd love to hear from you. Be well. So we are here and we are shooting some awesome summer content and awesome bathing suit content here. We've got Melanie in this one piece tight medical center, one of one exclusive uh, one piece bathing suit, which looks fire right now. Um, it's going to obviously fit you perfect to a T like a glove. Um, so that's what it's all about is um, not only looking good, feel good, performing better, but being at your all-time best, optimal in every way, shape, or form. And you know, you put in all that hard work in the gym and with your nutrition and sleeping and all these good stuff. Why, right? And it could be for a personal gain uh, for yourself or a goal. But you know what? You're gonna look good when you go out to the pool, to the beach, or even in the bedroom with your partner. You're gonna look ultimately the best you possibly can, right? So, you know, if you wanna be your best, this is definitely one bathing suit that's going to make things stand out in a really good way. Call Titan Medical Center today at 727-389-3220 or visit us online at titanmedicalcenter.com. 
You're watching a Titan Medical Center production. I love being a patient of Titan Medical Center. From the atmosphere to the service, everything is always amazing. I would recommend Titan Medical Center for anybody who wants to be the best version of themselves. The human body is made up of many different parts, all of which have a special function. At Titan Medical Center, we can help you so that your body and mind can perform at optimal levels. Our unparalleled level of care, compassion, and professionalism is what sets us apart. Our patients are our number one priority. Call us today at 727-389-3220 or visit us online at titanmedicalcenter.com and become part of the Titan Medical Center family. What's up, guys, and welcome to Cupid's Corner with me and my beautiful wife, Sharice. Hey, everybody. Every week, me and my beautiful wife here are bringing you guys tips, tricks, and things that are going to really ignite, excite, and take your relationship to all new, healthy, and great levels. You know, this stuff that we always share with you guys, this information is either experience or things that me and Sharice have went through as a couple, or our friends or other people we've seen out there that we've observed go through some of these situations or some of these different things that maybe you shouldn't do if you're in a relationship or trying to be in a relationship. And this is for both guys and girls across the board. And if you're in a relationship, maybe you guys can take some of these little tidbits and enhance your relationship to be even better because it's all about progress, moving forward in whatever you do in life. It can always be better, right? right? Always be better, whether it's your relationship, your job, your personal finances, your personal body and health, everything can change and you can be the one to change it. You are in charge of your own destiny and hopefully your relationship. But a relationship always takes two people. So you guys two always tango. Right? Always tango takes two alone, tango. Right? I don't think so. Maybe it was an invisible partner. <laughs> I could dance around and shake it. Yeah, blow up doll or something. Yeah, see, <laughs> see, it can be done, but you always want a live, right? partner hopefully yes. uh, and a human at that point Some very strange things happening out there nowadays guys so who definitely knows? definitely 100 <laughs> percent take away with casper <laughs> yes so you know basically this uh topic we're going to talk about today is going to be anniversaries see now this anniversary could be if you're with your girlfriend with your fiance boyfriend whatever husband wife um you know how important they can be right and anniversaries should signify you coming together as a couple um, and you should be able to go back to memories all throughout the years and however long it is. And me and Sharice's 16th year anniversary. 16 years. You're was, going the second decade. Yeah, it was on January 21st. So, you know, we brought some of the different things that, you know, I got for Sharice for her anniversary. I'm going to make presents. sure to plug in John's part. Watch. And, uh, you know, if you guys don't know what these are, it's Venus Lafleur. It's awesome. These roses, they smell for a whole entire year. Or maybe even longer. I have them in my house, and some of those boxes in that house are literally like they're probably like seven or eight years old. Yeah, and they still yeah. are preserved. Yes, it's yes. crazy. Yes. they're expensive, but if you have flowers that you say you spend a couple hundred bucks on some flowers, yep. and they're beautiful for like four or five days, and then yeah. they're they're dead, they die, whatever. I mean, trick of the matter, you can actually take one, you can hang it upside down, Absolutely. spray hairspray on it, and it'll actually last for quite some time. Yeah. Anyways. But not but, with the smell. <laughs> not with the smell, but you'll still, keep, smell. you'll still keep the rose. But these, they last forever. Like, I mean, literally forever. I mean, and, you should see our house. Yeah, and these are real roses too. So um, they've definitely been preserved, but as far as there's no hairspray or anything like that, they keep <laughs> the smell. Um, and you can change all these different things, patterns, whatever it is, boxes, yeah, colors of so roses. Cool. I've done all different types of things through the years because, you know, for anniversary, for birthday, you know, you're going to get, I, I like to get her roses and I always have I like um, from the start. And you know what? These are like $475. Now you're saying, man, John, that's really expensive. That's out of my budget. It's a year's worth of love. Okay. Listen, 
So 475 divided by 12. What I, is it? I understand. But, but remember, you got Valentine's Day as a guy. We're not talking about Valentine's you Day. You got now. birthdays. We're talk, right now, we are not talking about birthdays either. And you we're guys not know. About, you we're all not know. We're not talking about Christmas. And we're not talk, talking about any other holidays. This is the anniversary. Okay. It's separate. So if you want to pick one day or anniversary, I guess, to, to buy these flowers, that's cool. Now, listen, if you're still saying this is it's just not financially feasible, it doesn't really matter how much the roses are or you don't have to get the roses. It's all about getting something that's very meaningful to I your know, partner. I was just going to say, like, my present to him did not cost this much money. And I'm like, oh, let's really hope that he likes it. I'm going to love it. <laughs> Because I, I really don't care about getting, I really don't care about the material gifts. It really, you know, I, I've been desensitized to that, I guess, through over the years. And as you get older, I think you start to realize, like, these material things are great and all, but that's not, like, the best thing you could possibly get from somebody. The best possible thing you get from somebody is something that truly comes from the heart. Whether they made it themselves, they wrote you a letter, they took you somewhere, like, just really nice. I'm not talking about an expensive date or anything like that, like, you know, you guys went out to the beach and you guys had great conversation. You guys enjoyed each other's company. You made it special. Mm -hmm. And I think that's the real kick here. It is. Is you got to make it special. And if you make it special, I don't care what it is. And if a girl or a guy is upset because it's not a materialistic thing and it's not expensive, then I think you might need to move mm -hmm. on from that. I need to reevaluate that for sure. there's a lot of people out there that that's what they're focused on. Like, hey, what did, it's usually their friends, like, what did your boyfriend or girlfriend get you? What's your husband? Oh, they got me um, like a rose. Oh man, that's he did the cheap way out. He should have took you to dinner. He should have, and you're like, hold on. Like, if that's okay for the person, then nobody else should get involved in their business. When me and John got together, we didn't have money. So like John literally would get the, like he would get me a dozen roses and then it was two dozen roses. And you know, you, you, as you, you know, mature on, if you do well and you're successful, then do what you can. And I mean, if not, it's all, I always try to customize something for John, like, or do something, even if it's just the card itself and make it like, like it actually just came from me and not yeah. just like a store or something yeah. like that. You know, um, I think that that's just more meaningful, especially to him because I mean, you got to ask yourself, like, what do you get somebody that ha has everything they can possibly want or they can go get, right? You got to give them something that they can't go buy, right? So when you hand it over, be like, you know, regardless if it was $1 or $100 or $1,000, you can't go get this, right? Because right? right. I made this, right? right? Um, but that's kind of the, you know, the kick behind it. Now, whatever you guys do out there, I, I give best advice for you is to set an alarm, do what you got to do. So you do not forget your anniversary. Forgetting your anniversary is bad. Yeah, you don't want This to is that. very, 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 very bad. Yeah. And having to come back from forgetting your anniversary, which my lovely husband has never forgot our anniversary, but some of you guys out there have. Um, don't do that. <laughs> it's not good. Having to come back from that is not good. And believe you me, us women out there, we're not stupid. And we know, you, you know when you've thrown it together in a couple hours because we mentioned it in the morning or something like that. And you're like, oh, what am I going to do now? <laughs> you go run and get something real quick and put it together. And they go, oh, there it is. You know, if that's the case, you better start thinking. And you better think real hard and real fast as to how you can make it, like John was saying, super, super special, super, super meaningful. You know, and as you, I mean, me and John have been together 16 years now. So, you know, tapped out on gifts, you know, like we've gotten all kinds of gifts. So now you got to start, you got to put some thought process behind it a little bit. For you guys out there, if you guys aren't on a financial budget, there's ways to get roses that you guys could probably find in your area at very inexpensive costs. Publix. Um, well, <laughs> if you're in Florida, Publix, right? If you're also in Florida, the Tampa area, there's flower outlets that you can actually go to and buy roses. And you can buy them for pretty, they're very inexpensive, let's put it that way. And then if you're in a different city and stuff like that, I'm sure there's places around you where you can find these different things. Um, and it won't be, like I said, it won't be breaking the bank on everything. It's not going to be expensive like this. Now it might not look as nice as this, or, <laughs> you know, and stuff like that. But, you know, like I it's said, the it, thought. It's, it's the thought that counts. It is the right? thought. It's the thought. And, uh, you know, even putting together something, you know, that mean, that's, that's meaningful on paper and giving it to them a card or whatever it is, that'll be a plus two. Don't just buy a card and don't write anything in it. You got to write something in it. Yeah. Uh, if, if you're not, not just, good, I love you either. If you're not good, I love you, John. I mean, I, I haven't done this, <laughs> but if, you, if you're not, go to chat GPT. Oh out. Write, write me something that's very romantic. If John ever went to chat GPT or whatever it's called, Jasper or whatever those things are out there, I would know 
like this. <laughs> like this. I would call that out so quick. <laughs> but listen, if you need some ideas, that would probably be the way to go. Um, so anyway, you could do, you, this is your gift part portion, right? Yeah. So you got to talk about the other portion, which is going to dinner, set a dinner date, go yeah. to a movie, set something up where it's just both you guys. Even if you guys don't have any money, cook dinner. Yep. Make a special night. Yep. Put some candles yep. around the house or yep. something. You know, our house is not the easiest to do something like that because we retired his father and we have a 14 year old in the house. So, you know, putting some <laughs> nice, wonderful candles up and everybody asking why are these in the house and what are you guys doing? You know, might cause some questions and figure out what's going on. It's a little, right. uh, but you know, if that's the case, go go to a hotel room. There's so many different ways you can spin this and so many different things you can do to make it a meaningful day. Absolutely. It doesn't matter. I mean, you, you know, probably Airbnb. Now I've never even done that, but you probably Airbnb somewhere. You know, Airbnb usually, is. usually me and John are out of town for our anniversary. That's this is, this is a, this is the time frame where we go out of town this yeah. in July, right? Yeah. Two times a year. Um, but this year we have a big event. We got festivals of speed, so we can't go out of town. So I'll try not to be too, you know, mean on that day. That's but. another thing you guys can do. You guys can plan a getaway. <laughs> And go have a getaway together, yeah, whatever nice, it is. You know, you know, it doesn't have to be a long time. It could be a day or two days or whatever. Yeah, it is. weekend or something. You know, uh, at that point, you guys will be able to enjoy each other's company, make more memories, have that private time for each other. Because you know, it's just so hard. Days you might be working different jobs, taking care of kids, all different types of things you might be doing. So at that point, setting aside that time is crucial. Um, and like I said, you can do a whole bunch of things in this time, right? You can just lay around all day together. My favorite. Uh, you know, or you guys could go Netflixing. do something, Net you know, together that, that you guys haven't done together, right? Or, you know, as, if you're in Florida, you have no excuses. There's so many different things to do in all the different times. If you're in Chicago, you still have no excuses. If it's cold outside, get some blankets and do something cute. Make snowing some day, snowing day. <laughs> so just remember, anniversaries are important benchmarks in your yes. relationship. Don't forget them. Now, it doesn't have to be all crazy like every week, every month, because there are people that do that. But it, but, it, but it should be every year. So at that point, every year, whether you're you just started the dating on that date or you've got married on that date, whatever it is, make it special and don't become com complacent. 16 years. I don't care if it's 20 years. Just keep doing it. It's all about progression. Your relationship is a job and you should be complacent on your job one way or the other. Right. Make sure on this day that you also recap some memories because memories and having and, you know, talking about them again, it always brings up obviously happy moments because you guys are together on this day for a specific reason. And yeah, that must've yeah. been a good day for you guys. Yeah. So that's it guys. Anniversaries are so important. So happy anniversary again to my beautiful wife, 16 years. Ah. And we appreciate you guys all join us for Cupid's Corner every Sunday at 11 AM. If you guys don't see it live, don't worry. You guys can either DVR it or you can hit all our social media platforms through Titan Medical Center, including YouTube. Just type in Titan Medical Center, hit the subscribe button, Ding. all notification bell, and you'll get to watch this episode and all the other Cupid, corner episodes and much much more cool content from time medical center so we'll see you next sunday for another cupid's corner with me and my beautiful wife sharice see you then